So recently I just learned a really nice technique or something I learned in Canva. And I think I'm gonna share with you in this video. I it's and it's about uh, creating different uh, shapes, really nice fancy borders. So I'm gonna show you actually how to lie, uh, how to add outline, very nice outline. This is gonna make your shapes look more interesting and more. It's gonna like uh, help you to help your shapes to. You're gonna add, you're gonna add this effect, this outline effect, and that's gonna make your shapes to pop out more on your design. Um, now it's, you know, imagine a regular circle, but an outline. It looks way more interesting, right? So let me show you what you have to do. And here we're gonna go to sh elements, and here in elements we click on. We can click on here on shapes and here we have a lot of shapes as you can see. I'm going to select this one. I can click on Simon A or I can drag and trap. But now here I have this shape. I'm going to click on this one here. I want to remove the fill so I can click on here. And I'm going to select this transparent so no background. And now I'm going to click on here border style and here I'm going to increase this uh, border weight and bo do uh, corner rounding so i would like to add some corner rounding and here i can change to add like this if i want to and that's just for the font now you can increase uh, the font but that's not something we want now what we want is to increase this, we can increase this shape, I'm going to leave this one, increase this, decrease, hold shift to lock in, you can drag like this, you can go to shape and click on other shapes, which actually, which is not, if you click on other shapes from here to change the shape, you'll keep the same, uh, the same settings options for all the other shapes from here if you were to click on here and then click on other shapes here this will not change you actually drag a new one if you click on this one you can also copy style and then uh, paste this style but you will not paste and you know this will not really make uh you will not remove the feel but um you know actually let's click on this one here and if you copy style you can click on this one here but as i said you will not copy the feel the actually no feel so you have to go here and edit you can also hold alt alt to duplicate and then control d to repeat the same step I think this can be very helpful you add one here and then you press sorry so click on this you hold alt and drag and hold shift so it locks in and then you click on the control d and then you hold control press control a and then alt shift to lock in and then press control and now you can also just sorry okay messed up very nice control a or just select hold alt and shift and alt and, sh and drag again control uh, now highlight everything and control g to group this and uh, now you might ask what's going to happen if i select i add a border to a group well it will actually change for all the as you can see for all the the shapes which is very nice and i can remove this uh, now and add this color or i can click on this and this is interesting <laughs> now you can do something it's all about your creativity how you use this shapes in your design and use these shapes in your favor so you add this 
and it's going to make your design look better because you can use this you can make your design look bad with this shape so it's all about how creative you are and how well you know to position the shapes to make your design look great now you can also resize this as you can see something like this which is interesting pretty nice maybe we can duplicate this and now I can highlight group and then now I use alt and duplicate okay this is, is already lagging uh, yeah so I hope we found this tutorial helpful thanks for watching